The Steelers will either rebound from their first loss of the late season last week or prove the haters right, as they travel to Buffalo in Week 14. I've compiled a list of predictions some basic, and some utterly idiotic to look for in this contest. Last week, I came close, but ultimately whiffed on most of my predictions. Let's see if I can rebound this week. Bogey Smith Schuster, upset that he won't get a chance to show the idiotic members of Bills Mafia that he's a crazier partier than any of them, is seen in the Buffalo Bills Stadium parking lot wearing a Steelers luchador mask, drinking hooch out of a bowling ball and diving through a flaming table. Unfortunately, his body weight isn't enough to break the table and let's just say there's not much worse of an aroma than the smell of burnt dog hair. Ray Ray equals TD James Washington with a score 2. The offensive line keeps Ben clean again for the sixth straight game of no sacks. Speaking of clean, Eric Ebron and Deontay Johnson keep the football in their hands and not on the ground with no drops. Bills quarterback Josh Allen is compared to Ben Roethlisberger at least 70 times. Steelers fans flood comment sections and message boards feverishly with claims that Chris Collinsworth hates the Steelers. That can't be further from the truth as it is forgotten that the NBC color analyst is a national treasure, Stefan Diggs torches the Steelers for 111 yards and scores twice. Dawson Knox, Buffalo's tight end, has a big night. Ben throws three touchdowns on the evening, with one interception. All in all, he throws over 50 passes again. Juju Smith-Schuster catches one of those TD passes and because he can't think of anything appropriate to do to commemorate the 17th anniversary of the capture of Saddam Hussein in Tikrit, the 202nd birth anniversary of Mary Todd Lincoln and Taylor Swift's 31st birthday. Juju celebrates his score by putting steel chains around his neck, writing the word, thump, on the back of his game pants, headbutting Tredavious White and barking like a dog to celebrate the 68th birth anniversary of Sylvester Ritter aka Hall of Fame wrestler, the Junkyard Dog. Vance McDonald as targeted scores his first touchdown of the season. A man wearing a custom Steelers Kylo Ren is spotted camped out at the Steelers Hotel waiting on inside linebackers coach Jerry Olsovsky. Citing his experience as a championship-winning high school coach and his experience as a safety that can play up in college, lobbies for a starting spot at ILB and even offers to wear the green dot. Tempted by this offer, Jerry O realizes that he can't sign the BTSC writer due to the five-day COVID waiting period and questions how the writer of Clerks would go over as a linebacker. Back in Maryland, a certain co-editor is heard yelling, Honey, we've got to get better locks. Steelers rack up five sacks. TJ Watt takes Josh Allen down twice. Cam Hayward, Mike Hilton and Alex Heisman all get one. 